All right, everybody, I'm LQ, back with the LQ Review, here to talk about all the nerdy, geeky stuff that us nerds and geeks love to talk about. Today I'm doing part three of my MCU trailer reaction videos. So the third movie in the MCU was Iron Man 2. So that's the trailer I'm going to be reacting to today. As we get closer to Avengers Endgame, I'm going to continue reacting... Oops. I'm going to continue reacting to these, uh, to these trailers as we... Um, start checking off the boxes until I've reacted to all the MCU movies leading up to Endgame. And as I've said before, hopefully eventually I'm reacting to an, a new Endgame trailer. We'll see how that plays out. Marvel seems to be play, keeping their cards awfully close to their chest. So let's watch this Iron Man 2 trailer and, uh, and see what they had in store for us. What they were selling us. Before Iron Man 2 actually came out. I, I've said multiple times Iron Man 2 is actually um, my second least favorite uh, MCU movie. Only The only one I don't like more than Iron Man 2 is Thor The, the Dark World. So let's ch take a look and, and check out what kind of movie they were selling us. Could we pick up now where we left off? Mr. Stark... Please. Yes, dear. Can I have your attention? Absolutely. And our priority here is to have you turn over the Iron Man weapon to the American people. Well, you can forget it. We're safe. America is secure. You want my property? You can't have it. But I did you a big favor. I have successfully privatized world peace. Robert Downey Jr. owns that character. Tony Stark, he owns it. Okay, give me a smooch for good luck. I might not make it back. <laughs> <laughs> you complete me. Stark Expo. Oh, it's good to be back. You come from a family of thieves and butchers. Quick laugh. Such a good concept of a character. They will be blood in the water, and the sharks will come. Ultimately, Whiplash was botched, but it's such a great concept. First appearance of Black Widow. The possibilities were there for Whiplash. Good scene! Ah! Man. Alright, so yeah, I've been on record. Iron Man 2 is, is, my, is one of my least favorite MCU movies. Um, I just feel like it was all about world building and less about story. And that was nothing... There was nothing more evident in that than the character of Whiplash. Whiplash was there to drive the, the narrative forward. He wasn't there for any real narrative reason. Um... And it was such a great concept of a character. The history with Tony Stark. The the, the vengeance that he had on his mind. Then the, the, mm -hmm. the actual technology that he put to use. And then he became a hammer puppet. And then he created his own Iron Man suit. And then we got another replay of many Marvel villains. Where the Marvel villain is the bad guy version of that villain. We saw it in Iron Man 1. With uh, the Iron Monger, Jeff Bridges' character. And then we see it in Iron Man 2 with Whiplash becoming yet just another bad version of Iron Man. Yeah, Iron Man 2 wasn't great, but there was a lot of great stuff in it. And obviously you got Rhodey, um, you've got the, the world building, which I do like the world building. I respect that. I don't want a movie to be to exist just for the world building. 
But you had the stuff with Coulson, um, um, uh, Nick Fury, Black Widow. I mean, there was great world building that happened in this movie. But it was all at the expense of any kind of narrative. So like I said, uh, I, I, Iron Man 2 will never go down as one of my favorite MCU movies. But I can't necessarily say it's a horrible movie. You know, even the worst MCU movies are, are still better than a lot of the trash that Hollywood puts out now. So, so yeah, I really liked uh, this trailer. This trailer was fantastic, and it sold... I guess you can say it sold the movie that we got, but it in some ways it sold a better movie. So that's just my opinion anyways. Maybe you're one of the people that loves Iron Man 2. There's a lot of you out there. If you do, that's completely valid. But uh, Iron Man 2 just didn't really work for me. So again, I'm LQ. This is the LQ Review with part three of our um, MCU trailer reaction adventure. Next one is what? Next one, I believe, is Thor. And then after that, we'll have Captain America, the first Avenger. And then we'll be going straight into the trailer for the Avengers. So that's, that's pretty exciting. So again, thank you. I'm LQ. This is the LQ Review. Thank you for being here as we talk about all the geeky, nerdy stuff that we love to talk about. Thanks, and I will see you next time.